What's up, man? This is Frank, and you know my videos are for educational purposes and, in, and entertainment purposes. Some of the information may be factual. Some of it may not be factual. So you always want to do your research. So check this out, man. I was watching this quick video, right? And when you watch this video, this video is a prime example of why black people always get used and abused by politicians, especially the Democratic Party. And this is the reason why, man, they can't, they're not able to tap into politics to get the things that they want. Because when they put people in office, man, it's based on identity politics and they being emotional. Now, this lady, man, she's going to articulate why she's voting for Kamala Harris. And to me, it's just my personal opinion. I think, man, she's probably the typical black person. It's just, it's, you know, she can't articulate nothing as far as policy as to why she's voting for Kamala Harris. She can't. All she can say in essence is she ain't she ain't Donald Trump. And that's it. And how she answered questions during the debate ain't got shit to do with policies, what she's going to create in the future, what she's done in the past as far as policies. It's just that she ain't Donald Trump. And she liked the way she answered questions. This is the reason why black folks can't get shit, bro. Check this out. See this black seed on it has many Harris, Harris. Why why Harris? Harris. Harris. Harris, Harris, Harris. Why why Harris? Because she makes sense. Okay. Even common sense. Yeah. She's been involved with this administration the last three and a half years. She's been heavily involved in the administration. What was your favorite accomplishment of hers over the last three and a half years? Uh, you know, she oversaw border policy, the Afghanistan withdrawal. She was heavily involved in. Uh, it, it, what is your favorite thing that she's done the last three years? My favorite thing is, is that she is making common sense and had a great answer for any political question that you ask her. Is she perfect? No. Do she know a little bit about a little bit of this and a little bit of that? Which is a great start. It's three years. You can't clean a house and know everything so for three years. You just see her as being able to um, really articulate her responses you when people are asking her she questions. Produce, and she's going to make a, a better difference than Donald Trump. Yeah. Hey, I'm talking, and I gotta go. Well, really quick, last question. I'm talking to a lot of people that are saying that they want Donald Trump because of <coughs> the economy the last few years. It hasn't gone back on track. Real wages are down. Well, people are struggling. Think of January what, 6th. Would you, what would you tell those people? Think of January 6th. Think of January 6th? Yes. Uh, Thank you for your time. Oh, uh, it's Harris. Harris. And see, bro, that's all they got, man. Talking points. Shit that come from mainstream media. January the 6th. They hate Trump. He's a racist. You see what I'm saying? She liked the way she answered questions. None of that shit ain't got nothing to do with policy. Nothing. She can't name one thing, man, that Kamala, that Kamala Harris did that benefited America, that benefited the American public. You see what I'm saying? Or she can't name one thing, man, that Kamala Harris did that's going to make America great again. That shit is crazy, bro. That's the reason why, man, in my opinion, man, black folks can't get nothing when, done when it comes to politics, man, because they, like I said, they vote off emotions and they vote off of identity politics. But thank you for taking time out to watch the video. Have a nice day.